a Cards with Michael production. What's up, YouTube? It's Cards with Michael. Today we're going to open another Modernizer 2 Collector Booster. Before I go too far, I do want to correct, make a correction. This is a foil borderless Ragavan Nimble Pilferer. In my last video, I said this was a non-foil and I valued it at about an 86, but it's actually like 140. Ding, ding, ding. So that means the last video, the total box value was actually this, 600 some dollars. Jeez. And if you haven't watched that video yet, go check it out. There's a little eye right here. Click on that and you will watch it. But without further ado, let's open this one up. This is another battle between Francis versus Randy, all right? And I think we might do some more of these. So if you are curious and you want to shot in the dark and winning a, a, a pack, um, well, comment up below and see if you can guess the total of the next one we do. No guarantees on the timing. I don't have anything lined up yet, but I definitely want to do more of these. These are probably, well, the most exciting boxes to open right now in print in Magic the Gathering. All right, let's get to it. Here we go. So these battles are all pretty straightforward. Each person gets five packs open in their name. They keep all the contents. Um, however, two of these packs, of course, there's 12 packs in total, will be anteed off. And those will be the prize packs. So we'll put those two right there and let's divvy these up. Two packs, two packs, two packs, two packs, and then pack each. Let's go. Francis, starting with you, pack number one of Collector Booster. Here we go. One, two, three, four. There's always four foil commons, two foil uncommons. Your etch foil basic land. This time it's the island. We're shot in dock hand. All right, it's like a dollar or two. World weary. Skipped the showcase or borderless rare. And it is a borderless Mishra's factory. Excellent. Here we go. Here we go. We have Squirrel Sovereign. Chainer. Nightmare Adept. Just a borderless etched foil. Okay. Oh, and there we go. Foil, borderless subtlety. Yes. Yes. Here we go. Very good. Oh. It's a shiny, pretty one. I like it. And of course, the market likes it as well. All right. Let's open a pack of Randy. Let's see how Randy does. Here we go. Doo -doo. We have our foil etched land and inevitable betrayal. No. Phantasmal Dreadmaw. And a Mark Tide Regent. Ding, ding, ding. All right. There we go. That's a hit. Let's see what else we got here. A Eula Queen Among Bears and a Foil Extended Art Brea's Apprentice. All right, so far both people have gotten a hit. Both battlers got a spicy blue hit, at least $20 a value, I'm pretty sure. Here we go, on to the next for Francis. We have a Gaia's Will, all right. Late to dinner and a Grief. Good Grief, very good. That's a borderless card. And, oh, beautiful Timeless Witness, Aramoeba, Ave, Progenitor Ooze, all right. Etched Foil, as well as a Foil Extender Calibrated Blast, no. All right, it's okay, there's still a hit in that pack. Randy, what do we got for you? Here we go. Here we go. One, two. All right, here we go. Here's our first rare, Carthalion, Extended Art, Lanus Cryptozoologist, all right. Chattish Storm, here we go. And Chance Encounter, Womp Womp, and a Foil Extended Art Void Mirror. A little bit of a soft pack right there, hoping for some better hits in the next. Francis, here we go. Box is definitely not as fire as the last one, at least from the get-go. This is a recalibrate. It feels a little light printed. Here we are. Oh, nice. Verdant Catacombs. Extended Art Rare. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, yes, yes. And what else we got in this box? Sithis. Harvest's Hand. That's not bad. That's not bad. Bloodhound. The Cookbook. I think that might be a buck. Bone Shards. See, say, weather like Captain. All right, all right. And a foil showcase dressed out. And this is one of the cards. I personally think this card is just a little egregious. 
in terms of uh <laughs> like what is this anyways okay next pack for randy this is pack number three for randy pack number six of the box here we go A Territorial Kavu Extended Art, Jade Avenger. Oops, skip the card. Ah, I got a dress down. All right. The Entumor, the Shambler, the Skill, and another Verdant Catacombs. Let's go. Etched Foil. All right. Can we get another Fetchy? A Sarah's Emissary Foil Showcase. All right, all right. All right, guys. We're about halfway through the box. Definitely not as spicy as the last one. You don't have to be too spicy to make your money back now that these collector boosters have depreciated in price a little bit. I guess if they started to go back on the rise again, maybe from that video I did. Just kidding. I think they're like 340 something right now on TCG. Here we go. Our Bachikari, Magus of the Bridge. Here we go. Fairy Seer. Scale up. There we go. Prismatic Vista. Etched Foil, and Usury, Fortune's Flame, Foil Extended Art. Okay, good to see another fetch land. It's the third in the box. Randy, let's go back to you. What do we got here? Let's see it. Okay, we got a Zabaz, the Glimmer Wisp. I think it's still hovering around a dollar. Search the premises. Okay, all right. Okay, here we go, here we go. Soul Talisman. All right, all right. And a foil showcase verdict command. Oh man, just a little soft on this. All right, Francis, last pack for you. You're definitely in the lead. Uh, yeah, you're just definitely in the lead right now. Let's see how much of a head start you can pull through. Here we go. Chef's Kiss. Very good, very good. Okay. Thought Monitor Showcase, all right. This slot is typically not that too valuable, so we're not looking for too much value there. Here we go. Ooh, Etched Foil Cabal Coffers. We'll take it, we'll take it. And finally, it's black, Richard Kane Ferguson, and it's a Profane Tudor Retro Foil, all right. That's what we got for Francis. Randy, let's see how you do. Let's go. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Peter the Volatile, no. You see this, this is like Rampaging Bay Offs. Seriously. Oh, 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 we got a Mythic, Howard Lion, and the Svelin of Sea and Sky. All right, all right, that's something, that's something. Okay, let's see, let's see. Third hit. And oh, resurgent belief, etch foil. All right, the final hit of this pack. Mila Pesic, rare, a foil borderless, shardless agent. I'm almost 99% sure this one is going to Francis. Let's see what the prize packs yield. Here we go. Prize pack number one for Francis. We have Timeless Dragon. Okay. Late to dinner. Oops, skipped it. Dakon Shadow Slayer. Beautiful. Borderless Planeswalker. And Upheaval with the weird etching. As well as a territorial cob. Oh, kind of a soft pack there as well. Maybe this final pack will have the goods. All right, Francis, let's go. Let's see. Let's see what we can get you. In this final, final prize pack. This planes is beautiful. Not all the edge foiling looks good, but this one actually looks not bad. Unmarked grave. Okay, let's so start. Thermo Taxi, yep, yep, that slot never really has anything too good nowadays. And Squirrel Mob, okay, okay. Oh boy, for all the marbles, 
Archmage's Charm. If that was just a force negation, this box could have been saved. I think the total of the box isn't terrible. Ball Coffers, the Triple Fetch Land, the Grief Subtlety. Here are Francis's totals. Here are Randy's totals. All right. And uh, guys, here's the total box value. Um, I'm going to go through the comments and see who got the closest value from the last video. And if you're, you know, feeling spicy, I'm pretty sure I'm out of loose co uh, Commander Legends, or sorry, Modern Horizons 2 collector packs. So it will be some type of prize like a strict saving collector pack or whatever. If we do another one of these, if you, you know, I'm going to always look at the video before. And if you get close enough, well, then you're the winner. All right, guys. See you on the next one.